Come Holy Spirit, come Holy Spirit, come Holy Spirit, let your fire fall. Lord Jesus, I pray for those who are going to watch and listen to these videos. I ask you to pour out your Spirit upon them now, that they may be filled like a reservoir. I ask that you bring peace to any troubled heart. In the name of Jesus. Shalom. Jesus wants to speak Shalom, so I am speaking it with him. From Divine Love. From Divine Love. Lord Jesus, I ask you to lift off any shoulders the burdens of life. If anyone's burdened, by the past or the present or the future. I ask you to lift those burdens off, Lord. In the name of Jesus, all those burdens be lifted off. And I pray for peace to come. I just blow peace. In the name of Jesus. Peace of Christ. I pray for a healing of any wounds in the heart as the power of the Holy Spirit comes. That day by day the wounds be healed deep in the soul. Day by day by day. Thank you, Jesus, just like in the heart. It takes a while, so is the soul. Praise you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. I just say to you, rest in the love of God. Rest in Jesus' name. I speak to your soul, for your soul to be quiet, to be at rest. For all the, storm, all the storms of the soul, be calm, to focus on the present moment. Don't think about anything of the past or the future. Just be still in the present moment. Be still in the present moment. Rest in this moment. Thank you, Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Lord Jesus, with your will, we put on the helmet of salvation, the breastplate of righteousness, the belt of truth, the sandals of eagerness to spread the gospel of peace. We take up faith as a shield, and the sword of the Spirit is the word of God. We pray this heavenly arm for ourselves and all our family and friends. <clears throat> Excuse me. And Lord Jesus, we just pray the blood, your precious blood, upon ourselves, our family, our friends, our households, our finances. And Lord Jesus, we just, in the name of Jesus Christ and by the power of his divine will, I break any and every curse placed against us, our work, our finances, our family, our houses. We break every single curse in the name of Jesus and by the power of his divine will has been placed against us, our finances, our houses, the ministry, our lives. In the name of Jesus and by the power of his divine will I break every single curse placed against us, our houses, our finances, our ministry, that we may walk in the freedom of the sons of God. <clears throat> and they're going to chant the Litany of St. Joseph. You can either try to join in or just receive, just receive 
if you wish to. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Noble offspring of David, pray for us. Light of Patriarch, pray for us. Spouse of the Mother of God, pray for us. Chaste Guardian of the Virgin, pray for us. Foster Father of the Son of God, pray for us. Zealous Defender of Christ, pray for us. Head of the Holy Family, pray for us. Joseph Most Just, pray for us. Joseph Most Chaste, pray for us. Joseph Most Prudent, pray for us. Joseph Most Courageous, pray for us. Joseph Most Obedient, pray for us. Joseph Most Faithful, pray for us. Mirror of Patience, pray for us. Lover of Poverty, pray for us. Model of Workmen, pray for us. Glory of Domestic Life, pray for us. Guardian of Virgins, pray for us. Pillar of Families, pray for us. Comfort of the afflicted, pray for us. Hope of the sick, pray for us. Patient of the dying, pray for us. Terror of demons, pray for us. Protector of the Holy Church, pray for us. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. He has made him Lord of his household and prince of all his, all his possessions. Let us pray. O God, who in your loving providence chose blessed Joseph to be the spouse of your most holy mother, grant us the favour of having him for intercessor in heaven, whom and as we venerate as our protector, you who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. I'm now going to do um an act of consecration to St. Joseph by St. Peter Julian Aymard. It's on the Consecration of St. Joseph, book page 237. I consecrate myself to you, good St. Joseph, as my spiritual father. I choose you to rule my soul and to teach me the interior life, the life hidden away with Jesus, Mary and yourself. Above all, I want to imitate the humble silence with which you shrouded Jesus and Mary. For me, everything lies in that self-abnegation like our Lord in his hidden life, making the world forget me by my silence and my practice of virtue. I consecrate myself to you as my guide and model in all my duties, so that I may learn to fulfil them with meekness and humility, with meekness towards my brethren, my neighbour, and all with whom I come in contact, with humility toward myself and simplicity before God. I choose you, good saint, as my counsellor, my confidant, my protector in all my trial difficulties and trials. I do not ask to be spared crosses and sufferings, but only from self-love, which might take away their value by making me vain about, vain about them. I choose you as my protector. Be my father, as you were the father of the Holy Family at Nazareth. Be my guide, be my protector. I do not ask for temporal goods, greatness or power. I ask only that I serve with fidelity and devotedness, my divine King. I shall honour, love and serve you with Mary, my mother, and never shall I separate her name from yours. O oh Jesus, give me Joseph, full father, as you have given me Mary, as a mother. Fill me with devotion, confidence and filial love. Listen to my prayer. I know that you will. Already I feel more devout, more full of hope and confidence in good Saint Joseph, your foster father and my spiritual father. Amen. So I pray, I pray with all my heart for you to have a peaceful day today. 
I pray, plead with Our Lady that she will grant you peace this day and that all will be well in the name of Jesus. And all those of you who tune into this, be assured of my prayers for you this day. Prayers for your healing, for your well-being, prayers for good to happen to you, prayers for you to take possession of the divine will and grow in your relationship with Christ. God bless you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.